Um, yesterday, we uh, woke up, we hit the, the Starbucks, got ourselves a little coffee, a little something to eat, and then we rolled over to pretty mellow bench spot in this like tennis court, basketball court type vibe. The bench is really cool. We could like move them around and it was a good spot to get warmed up in and just get the legs going. And everyone I feel like was able to skate it and had a good time. I was, I was doing my thing, Mario was going off, uh, Yanko was going off, is that how you say his name? Yako, Yako was going off too, it was crazy, like I never seen him, I haven't really seen him skate in person too much anyway, but skating the legend with him yesterday, like he can, he can do it all, dude's gnarly. But uh, yeah, he was getting a bunch of stuff, it was cool to skate with him, yeah, it was a fun session. Saves the center store for our south side skate park in Houston. It's my first time here, so I'm excited. I don't even know how the skate park looks. Let's see. South side, yeah, we've been there a few times, but south side's always a good demo, fun park. I mean, it's it's like the only park that I really knew of coming into this trip. And I was like, oh, we're going to south side, like sick. Like dudes are always super cool there. Hospitality's great the park and the turnout and the skate scene he's got going at Southside is is really sick. Yeah. 
Welcome to Southside Skate Shop, Saints and Sinners, stop number two. We're out here. Yeah, man, Yako, he was going into the demo and the trick he was trying, he was trying to like, I guess, stall off the bank, like the highest thing. There's like a, a wood level and then there's like a higher fence behind that. And he was trying to stall the fence, come back into the bank. Yeah, I mean, it was gonna end the demo one way or another. Uh, I wish he would have just landed it. That would have been great, but no, nah, he took a gnarly slam. Definitely ended the demo, but everyone just made, wanted to make sure he was okay. And he's chilling, he seems like he's doing fine. They got him checked out a little bit last night and he'll be all right. Yanka.
there it is. Yeah, man. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Yeah. 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 Butterfingers. <laughs> Still in Houston right now. Stopped off at the skate park to get warmed up at, um, and then maybe hit a few spots. Um, but then we're out. We're going to Baton Rouge, so we got a four-hour drive ahead of us. Just gonna see what we can do in Houston and then bounce. I feel like we're all starting to mesh. I mean, this is what like the third, fourth day of the trip. Fourth day, I think. At first, I feel like we were staying in our own crews and our own vans or whatever, uh, not really hanging out so much at the spots. But then like. Little stops like Starbucks, we all start lurking, we're all kicking a soccer ball, we're all starting to get it going, you know, where we're like actually hanging out with each other. They they definitely like live a different lifestyle than we do, I feel like, on trips. They're doing their thing all day, they're drinking, they're having fun, but also really gnarly and skating and all that stuff. But yeah, well, I think we're still figuring it out, but by the end of the trip, I'm sure we'll be all one. Who's been your like favorite dude like watch from the Santa Cruz crew? Fucking Wukonski. You know, but one and done. <laughs> now nah, everyone is here, everyone is fucking skating, having fun. We out.